Okay. And I have a question about your Wii's. What would you do if I bought like three of them? Deal with the life? I know they're just stacking up on you. Super I got my Sega Genesis, yeah, I got, got my PlayStation 2, I got Nintendo 64, yeah. a GameCube black in the blue. Yeah. It's time to hang out with my game, it's time to empty that beer. Yeah. It's time to hang out with my game, out my Final Fantasies here, here, here. Yeah, I got my Super Nintendo and my Wii U, Wii U. So, so it's, it's time to hang out with my game. game. Where is the hill? Hamburger Hill, Amityville, where am I going? What's up, nerds and nerdettes? Random7 here, back with another episode of Friday Night Pickups. We're on episode 59, guys. Big shouts out to Jeff. Big shouts out to Justin over at Trademark for making this game possible, guys. I had to figure out what the heck I'm going to bring to the table. And I definitely had enough, guys, and I got this game. I'm very, very excited. So shouts out again, Justin, for making this possible. And everybody, just wow. This week was crazy. We also got a whole bunch of great deals, guys. First National Pond did not disappoint. Wow. Anyways, guys. We got Silent Hill Downpour. Wait, old news. Already had that game. Silent Hill Homecoming, PS3. Wait, wait. Oh, I have that game too. Silent Hill 4, The Room. Wait, I have that game too. Silent Hill HD Collection. No, that's garbage. Silent Hill 2, y'all remember this for a dollar first National Palm, but I have this game too. Anyways, guys, we're missing a couple games. We got one of those today. Hit those likes. Subscribe if you haven't. Random 7, let's go get this game. Let's go. Alrighty guys, since Justin works all the time, I'm going to be a good guy. Go pick up Superman for the Genesis forum since it's 25% off, booth 45, and then I might pick up something for myself. So let's go look around again. Tecmo Super Bowl is 20 bucks. And then what's that say? Windwater Rage. It's like a $15 game. I got it marked at five. And then Metal Gear, a little beat up. That's seven dollars. It's not too bad. Is that NES game right there? Twenty-two bucks. And then, can I get that Superman one? Yeah. No, I don't want that one. Okay. Thank you. I appreciate it. No rest for the wicked. How much is the... Oh, that super punch out. There's punch out right there for the Super Nintendo. Yeah, how much is that one? 35. 35? Alrighty guys, just got to First National Pond. I got to thinking, um, I'm gonna go in there and ask them if they'll do a deal on those Nintendo Wii's backwards compatible because they got a crap load of them. So let's go ask somebody and see if we can get a deal. Let's go. How's it going? Am I balling a game? Persona 5. Hey, you're pretty bald. Ten on these still, boss? Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'll do it up. Okay. And I have a question about your Wii's. Okay. What would you do if I bought like three of them? I know they're just stacking up on you. Well, I'm. I was just going to look at the black ones, yeah. Preferably the three with the lids. I don't know if they're all backwards compatible, though. Some were not backwards compatible, so I'm not interested in those ones. History lesson. That one wasn't. This one's not. Backwards compatible. What the hell does that mean? The, you see those controls right there? Those yeah. That plays GameCube games. The GameCube oh, came out before the Wii, so when the Wii's came out, they made them so you can play the GameCube games. Oh. 
So that's, that's so these ones were made after to save money. So they originally, you know, did this. Oh. So yeah, you could put a GameCube game so in here. you like the ones with the lids, but they're not what you want. No, this, these are the ones I want. Yeah, but these you want ones. the lid. You can always find these lids. What's, what makes these more expensive is the GameCube built inside. See, like that one's a GameCube one. That one's a GameCube one. This one. But I'll bet you these aren't. Yeah, if the lid comes off, they are. Oh. Yep, those are all GameCube ones. It's a bad design. Yeah, they fall off so easily. Yeah, it's, it's horrible. Yeah, $20 all day. Well, I'm glad I asked about these uh, Wii's. It's doing $20 a pop, so I'm doing two of them. And then he's throwing the Wii games in. And then $10 on Persona 5 Steelbook Edition. So not bad here at First National Pond. 50 bucks. Let's go. Should have got one more. Pretty good deal here at First National Pond, guys. A couple Wii's, some games, all the, all the fixings. 50 bucks. See you on the next one. Na, 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 na. Well, yesterday, guys, was way better at the garage sale than today. Only made 20 bucks, but that is okay. Justin texted me. He noticed a game at yesteryears. He wanted me to swoop up for him, and yes, I did. Superman for the Sega Genesis. So he said he's pretty sought after this game, so we're going to go in there and surprise him with this game. Oh, yeah, I should probably say trademark video games. Guys, we got two backwards compatible Wii's for 40 bucks with all the fixings. That's a pretty freaking good deal. Definitely make my money back with that. And then last thing, this is my personal CD. And this thing I've had for years and years, guys. I'm a rapper, if you didn't know. Random 7, that's where it comes from. Anyways, blah, blah, blah. We're going to go get this uh, cleaned up so it plays good. Anyways, let's go. This motherfucker talking that shit. I'll be right back. You're not supposed to swear on the channel, Justin. Jeez. <laughs> Sorry. You know what's right nice about my channel? There is no rules. Nice. I'm not controlled by YouTube. That's right. Rebel without a cause. I got four platinums. Watch, it doesn't play. And nice little blowing. It's an AV. So yes, AV. Be a red light here. Yeah. It does, it's doing Science. something. Yeah. Yeah, it's this. It's the power. Try a different power cord. I don't think the system's bad. It's just. <laughs> I don't have a power cord. I'm just gonna toss that one. Because the first gen doesn't fit. Nope. In that. A little fun fact for you nerdos out there. Might be the Genesis. It's doing the same thing. So yeah, don't throw this cord away then. We're just ruling things out right now. Yeah. I got a fever. And the only cure is more blow. It's the Genesis. This needs no red light. Okay. Never mind. I stand corrected. Just Come on, had to give Justin. it a good old blow. I had one of those growing up. You had to blow in it. It's like my ex girlfriend. <laughs> Sunsoft. Huh? Blizzard? Wow, that looks good. That's crazy because you wouldn't expect this kind of music in a Superman game. It's kind of dark. Oh. Start the game. Nobody wants to see the options. Are you for the game? Coca Cola out of the way. A peaceful summer evening when suddenly Joe Biden became president. I, I, I love the whole Superman crossover. What does that go for? Complete? Ooh, power failure. Three hundred. About a hundred dollars a piece. Hundred for the manual. Hundred for the box. Hundred for the game. There's not many copies on eBay, even car only. Clark Kent. I'm a, I'm a Batman or a Superman guy. This was a good Superman. Reminds me of Maximum Carnage. 
down. Alright, let's see how good you are. You're gonna die right away. Come follow me down here, Lois. Let's go. Hell yeah. Well, I'm glad you uh, like it, Justin. Hell yeah. Superman, Superman Justin, yeah. Alrighty, guys. Just got back home. So we got uh, two Nintendo Wii's backwards compatible, which means you can play GameCube games for 20 bucks a piece, guys, with all the fixings. The fixings kind of look like shit. I'm going to be honest, but... I mean, everything's here. Just talking about, like, without the back, none of them turn on. These ones have these battery packs on, which are annoying. But the sensors are here, the bricks are here, power cords are here. Will that be an AV cord? Yeah, I don't even know what this one is. But we are going to test out the, the Wii's. I'm pretty sure they work. And then, you know, at the end, maybe we get a bonus, bonus game. So that would be cool. Anyways, let's plug these bad boys in and get them a go. Alrighty guys, got it hooked up. Got the sensor rocking. See if she powers on. Good sign. So we're gonna have to see so yeah, on the controller, hit the red button and the red button right there. We're gonna sync the remote. Anyways, now for the good part guys, let's drum roll. See if we got a bonus game. Aww, Jeopardy, favorite quiz show, well, that's funny, <laughs> anyways, it works, pretty cool, um, let's test out the second one, see if we can get something good, I don't know, cardio workout, hit the eject button, which one is that, that's one right there, I see that already in the corner, That's the good one, too. It is. That's why I had to come get you, because I saw it already up there when I turned it on. Oh, Wii man. Sports Resort, one of the best games to get for a free game when you buy a Wii. Especially for $20. Pretty cool. Not stealing, but wheeling and dealing. Alrighty, guys. So, this black one, I forgot to test the GameCube game, but we're going to try it on the white one instead. And the GameCube game I got yesterday. Pretty cool. I think it goes in like this. And it'll pop up GameCube in the corner. And you gotta actually go. Oh, this is my Indigo GameCube. That's cool. So the GameCube works in this as well. I mean, guys. $20 for a GameCube slash Wii. You can't beat that. Go out and get those backwards compatible Wiis. They play those GameCube games. Phenomenal. And they look good. Oh, Alrighty, guys. See you on the next one. Peace. Uh, what's it gonna be? Oh, Whoa! Nice. I will be back for that Xbox One. I will. Is that part of this? It might not be. <laughs> oh, you're not gonna be here? No, I said it might not. Oh, yeah, I know. It's <laughs> sold. Stopped at First National Pond in the Heights. Got Mario and Rabbit's Kingdom Battle sealed <laughs> 10 bucks sweet thanks guys when you're feeling pissed off at the video game store because they had some games and they don't have them no more we're at trademark video games yeah so justin showed me some pictures of like silent hill 3 4 and some other games guys but they're all gone at least silent hill 3 i'm really bummed out and i got a uh, trade pile put together and everything but what do you do? Uh, we're going to go in there anyway, see what he gives us for trade. And um, yeah, see if we can get a game we don't have, guys. This is just doubles. Stuff I got up for pretty cheap. So let's go in there and let's go find that game. Hey, Justin, where is it? Where's what? Where is it? I don't fucking see it, dude. Where the hell is it? Were you working Monday? No, I wasn't. Who stopped in Monday? Well, the Street Fighter was. Yeah. Hey Justin, can I check out Mario Superstar Baseball, please? Oh yeah, yeah. What's Tales of Zilla? Tales of Zilla? Yeah, right there. What is that? Up oh, by Spider-Man, yeah. Oh, it's sealed. 
Oh, it's another RPG. Yeah. Dude, Namco made so many RPG games. They did. Sweet. They used to be Was it on there? Yeah, oh wait, I think this is a Battle City. See? Nam Namcot. Yeah, if you look it up, they Oh, drop. so Namco used to be Namcot. Yeah. Huh. We learn something new every day. Alrighty, guys, I'm interested in Mario Superstar Baseball. Let me talk to Justin and see what he'll do, and we'll go from there. That's cool. $150, guys. I got mine for a buck at First National Pond like four, I don't know, three years ago, something like that. Two years ago. Yeah, about two years. Silent Hill Origins, that came out after because that has, that doesn't have the original PlayStation 2 case. 1996. Back in 1996. Yeah, I still have it. Right? Yeah, I made this because like um, I got the foods. disc only online, mm. like through eBay or something, and it, I didn't, it didn't come with the case, so. This, I finally got full copy of that, so I just put that in my binder. And then these, yeah, I just got these. These were on my last episode. Four bucks a piece. Solid. Yeah. Anyways, guys, trademark. He's traded straight across for Mario Superstar Baseball. Very excited. Only for the Nintendo GameCube. And it's complete. Very happy. Really sad that Silent Hill 3 was here and it <clears throat> missed it. I'm going to get you, Jeff. Anyways, guys, I'll see you on the next one. Thank you, Justin. All right, well, give me that Nights into Dreams. That's what he's looking for. Yeah, I'm gonna get it's it right now. Dreams. I got 300 bucks right here. Got the wallet out and everything. Sorry, Jeff, I'm snagging it. Yeah. Grab it. Yeah. Today he goes home. I'm not even gonna put it on the video. I'm gonna bring it home, play it, not tell anybody about it. Thanks, Justin. Here, 300 bucks. Here you go. I'm just playing, Jeff. You know I love you. Alrighty guys, in the game room right now, and good news, Justin has a copy of Silent Hill 3. I think Jeff brought it in, so thank you so much, Jeff. We are going to look around and get some trade stuff together, guys. He wants 150 for it, so I'm thinking I'm going to put some games together, and um, yeah, we're going to try to get $150 worth of trade credit, guys. Go over there and get Silent Hill 3. I'm very excited, so let's pack some stuff together, guys, and let's do it. I have stuff in the car. I was just going to wait till you weren't busy. So, dude, I appreciate it. Uh, Jeff, too, thank you. I got something coming in the store that you're going to like. So, yeah. Well, he did, you know, he didn't have to. He texted me. He's like, I brought in Silent Hill for you. You know, it's at the store, blah, blah, blah. So, appreciate it. All right. I'm going to go grab my stuff. And I hope I have it covered, Justin. So, let's go get it. When you're having a crisis and you're out of time. Time crisis four. I got that at first national pump for five bucks, like yeah. last year. You've watched that episode. Yeah, you're right. Goes for 150 bucks. Complete. Miss Pac-Man for the Nintendo with the manual. Coraline Nintendo DS complete guys. We got Tecmo Super Bowl, Time Crisis 4, Guncon 3, Dragon Ball Z, Tech Team Tech Michi, Sega Genesis, all for Silent Hill 3. Let's go. Well, we're gonna go through this when he's not busy, guys, and we'll get back to you. Got some pretty good stuff, so hopefully it's enough. Yeah. Yeah. Bye. Bye, Guncon 4. Yeah. It's gonna be sitting next to three. So Justin's being awesome. He's giving me 170 store credit, so. We could pick up another $20 game, but Silent Hill 3 guys coming home with random. Very excited. I just got to track down the, the bonus disc that came with it was the soundtrack. So once I uh, track it 
track that down, guys, I'll be a lot happier with this game. But very excited. This is probably going to be what I'm doing this weekend. Thank you, Justin, again. Really appreciate it. You got some stuff I don't play and a little more top dollar this time. That's what you get. You guys cleared out my Silent Hill yes. games. And there's still Man. more down there. I would love that Origins, but... Two and three now are in my collection. I'm really happy with that. So let's go find a $20 game, guys, and we'll get back to you. It's not bad. Hey, Justin. Would you do Ark the Lad End of Darkness? Okay. It's your five dollar rule. I have five bucks if you want. Okay. But, I, uh, <clears throat> appreciate yeah. it. That's right, what the man said. Um, Justin and not worrying about the five bucks. And then guys, Silent Hill 3. Holy shit. Very excited about this. Uh, worth the trip over here to Trademark today. Really good game. It's going to look really cool next to uh, Silent Hill 2. It wasn't a dollar, but guys... This is the way to go. Get some stuff you don't want. <laughs> Anyways, oh yeah, guys. Great time here at Trademark. I will see you guys on the next one. Holy buckets. Thank you, Jeff. Thank you, Justin, over at Trademark for hooking me up with Silent Hill 3. I'm Random7. Hit those likes. Subscribe if you haven't. And I'll see you on the next video. Peace.